Miami football. As rich and vibrant as the city they play in. From the perfection of 72. To a perfect Marino pass. Shining with their community. These are the Dolphins. is a celebration. It's the Dome Patrol. And Drew Brees lifting a city out of despair to stand together as a community. These are the Saints. Hey, what is going on guys? T.Sports15 here and today we have another episode of the Miami Dolphins Connected Franchise Owner Mode uh, here in Madden NFL 25. So here, this is going to be week 4 action. We are 2-1 and one, um, after beating the Cleveland Browns week 1, losing to the Colts week 2, and then beating the Falcons in a big upset in week 3. Now we are taking on the Saints. They are 1-2 and two after uh, winning 1 and losing 2. So um, we have a chance to move to 3-1 and one which would be a great start for the Miami Dolphins. But right here, Moore is going to take this one for a big gain after catching that on the curl route and then breaking away and uh, getting a lot of yardage. So here, Drew Brees is going to find Moore again, and that will get them on the board here early. On their first drive, they score a touchdown, and we are already down. We get the ball on our first drive with about five minutes left in the first quarter. Tannehill dropping back. He is going to throw to the left side. He's going to find Eric Decker, but he will not be able to get the first down. We had fourth and two. Fourth and two, we kicked it away. They get the ball back with good field position on their own thirty, uh, on their own forty-three. They're gonna go with the screen play here to Pierre Thomas, and he's gonna get down to about the thirty-five uh, with that first down catch and his first catch of the game. So they're having a good start to the game. We are definitely not. So Drew Brees dropping back here. He is going to find Jimmy Graham out of the backfield, and he is going to get down all the way to the two-yard line. So they have a chance to put up another score here. Down to about two minutes left in the first quarter. Drew Brees is going to get hit as he throws there. That'll send it to third down, so they have to convert here. Sec, sec, Two-yard line, sorry, and uh, third down. He's going to get a once again hit as he throws, and that will force them to uh, hit this field goal here and settle for three points. So uh, they do make it after it was only about a seven-yard uh, field goal, and they do uh, take the 10-point lead. So here, Tannehill's going to hand this one off to Lamar Miller he's gonna get break free and he's gonna get about 15 yards there 15 16 yards um, and that's a good start to the game for him he's gonna find Lamar Miller over the right side tries the hurdle terrible play and that will be a fumble uh, the guy who actually hit him caught it as well off the fumble so it's a little bit weird but uh, here starting off the second quarter Drew Brees third and one he's gonna find Watson in the flat on the left side and he was wide open easily gets the first down our safety was injured on the play but he would be able to return there so first and 10 drew Brees looking around and this one is going to be picked off by taylor and that will get us the ball back one more thing i had to point out if you guys haven't noticed already in the uh, last episode, Mike Wallace was injured as Tannehill does get sacked there for a pretty big loss by Butler. But uh, we, in the last episode, Mike Wallace was injured. He's going to be out this week and three or four more, depending on how severe, how things play out. So three or four more weeks after this. So we went out and I didn't want to trade for any more uh Oh, any more wide receivers because we do have some pretty good depth but I wanted to get a few more guys in the mix uh, with a little bit more goodness or like better overall and stuff so we went out and we signed Randy Moss and Brandon Lloyd so two pretty big signings so here we go we're down to their 22 yard line first and 10 Tannehill dropping back he's gonna find Eric Decker over the left side who is going to fumble and that will be our team's second fumble of the day Tannehill has been making the passes he hasn't thrown a pick yet 
yet but uh his receivers have been fumbling it so here drew Brees gets the ball back at about midfield he's gonna be looking over the middle for jimmy graham and he's gonna get the first down and a little bit more so they have second and three here on our 35 yard line we're controlling Dion jordan who i really like to uh control my ends either Dion jordan or cameron wake because they're two of our best defensive players so right here he's gonna hand this one off to pierre thomas he's gonna break through and he's gonna get down to about the 10 yard line with the first down so first and 10 here almost first and goal they are in the red zone here and and uh, Drew Brees is going to drop back he's going to find Pierre Thomas he's going to pick up a block and he is going to be into the end zone there so they take the 17 point lead here we got a minute 52 left in the first half and we're going to find Brandon Lloyd here he cuts to the outside and he has a lot of running room but he's going to be run down by the defender at about the 20 yard line 16 yard line now third and five we have to convert here Tannehill looking around and he is going to find Dustin Keller there on that play over the middle Tannehill dropping back here another throwing play first and goal he's going to find Lamar Miller he's going to get popped there he gets injured and he will be out for the rest of the game so Daniel Thomas in the game and we're going to be throwing to Daniel Thomas who makes the catch and gets the touchdown so Daniel Thomas already making an impact in his first action of the season Lamar Miller would be out for at least the rest of the game we'll see about him in the next episode so after we get the stop there that'll do it for the first half you can see some stats coming up in just a second we are down 17 to 7 after that nice clutch touchdown to end off the first half but uh, we do need to put the foot on the gas pedal if we want to come back we're still down 10 points and we need our offense to come through see you can see there down 17 to 7 the uh, stat line and all the team leaders and stuff are going to be coming up in just a second you can see right here um that the halftime reports is it only shows up for a quick second but uh we are leading in two of the five categories so here we go starting it off on our own 16 yard line Tannehill got slant plays. Where is he going to go? He is going to look to the left side. He's going to find Brandon Lloyd, who tries to spin off, but he gets stopped there. So handing this one off to Daniel Thomas. He's going to bounce to the outside. He's got some running room, and he will get the first down. And a little bit more, he does. Somebody gets injured. One of their defenders gets injured there, but uh, he would be okay. So you can see we have second and 10 here. Tannehill dropping back. Where is he going to go with this one? He looks. He drops way, way back. Finds. Dustin Keller over the left side and he will be stopped there at about the 20 yard line so um some more things I wanted to talk about in this commentary is um this is going to be coming out a lot more often now that I have a little bit more time that uh, hockey's like underway and uh, we don't have the uh, preseason tournaments and stuff uh, the early birds and stuff but uh, I just got GTA 5 today so that will be coming out soon so uh, stay tuned for that if you guys are just uh, viewers of this series because I know there's a lot of people that like this series um definitely go check out that gta series that's coming up today so he's gonna throw it to watson there he's gonna get big yardage there so down to our eight yard line he's gonna hand this one off to pierre thomas who's going to fumble that one on the two yard line cameron wake picks it up but he cannot stay on his feet so we have it at our two yard line so that's good 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 play there by our defense but Definitely a stupid play coming up here. Tannehill going with the read option, and they had us played well. Nowhere to go with that one. I, if I handed it off, he would have been stopped, and Tannehill gets stopped for the safety. So they, even though we did get the ball back there, we kick it away. We have actually punted away right away. So Drew Brees looking around on his four, on our 43-yard line. He's going to find Graham there over the right side. We're getting near the end of the third quarter. First and 10 now in the red zone. And uh, Drew Brees is going to have about a minute 40 left in the third quarter. He's going to find Colston over the right side. And that will get them to second and goal here on the four-yard line. Uh, I formation for Pierre Thomas. He's going to pitch this one out. He picks up a block and he will be in to the end zone untouched and they expand their lead to a 15 point lead now up 25 to 10 they want to go for two so it'll make it a two touchdowns and a field goal 
for us to just tie it up drew Brees looking around and he is going to get sacked by cameron wake his first sack of the game and that will get us uh hold us within for 15 points so Tannehill looking around now that we're down 15 he's going to try to throw it to the left side try to find eric decker lewis picks it off and he will take that one down to about the 11 so nearing the end of the third quarter they already have the ball back and we need a big stop here but he's going to find jimmy graham over the middle that'll be another touchdown and they take the 22 point lead after kicking the uh, extra point Tannehill back on offense our own 18 yard line he's gonna look deep right side eric decker finds a man and he will get us down to the uh 25 yard line or something but tier 24 we're gonna find brandon gibson there after going for it on fourth um a very clutch throw there even though we're not even close in this game Tannehill gonna hand this one off actually fake it he's gonna find dustin keller in the end zone that'll get us on the board once again and we pull within a few touchdowns so one thing is that if you guys are wondering why my it, it might be i don't think it's gonna be too bad but uh my audio might be a little bit off as you see cameron wick gets his second sack of the day um my audio might be a little bit off because my uh my preview screen is a little bit delayed so here we go we got first and 10 here down at their 30 yard line Tannehill looking around and he is going to find Eric Decker who breaks away and he gets into the end zone so that'll bring us within a touchdown and the two point convert if we can do it we are now within eight points so he's gonna find he's gonna hand this one off to Pierre Thomas who's gonna get the first down but we still have our three timeouts we use one there so we need a big stop here third and 11 we need a big stop here he's gonna hand this one off to pierre thomas who's going to get a few blocks and he gets the first down and that will do it for this ball game guys we do go on to lose it was a pretty close game after a nice comeback at the end so you can stick around for the box scores at the end the player of the game was drew Brees, um and there should be some more of this series coming out uh, a little bit later in the week uh so that was week four we moved to two and two uh the saints moved to two and two as well lamar miller is going to be out for about five to eight weeks so he's gonna be out for a little bit a little bit we're gonna play with uh daniel thomas for the next little while we're not gonna be going making an acquisition i might 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 go for a free agent halfback um i think mcgahee's out there and turner so um let me know who you guys think i should go for if we do want to go that route but i think we should just roll with daniel thomas until lamar miller gets back and then he'll have his starting roll back once he does get back so you can see the stat line on the way out there's the play of the game uh that play there uh to the right side on that curl route so once again guys if you guys do like gta go check out that series that's going to be starting up later today so thank you guys for watching i will see you guys in the next one peace